All right, guys, check this out. I recently started watching K drama, and for those of you who don't know what K drama is, that's Korean drama. And I have always been a fan of J drama, and J drama is Japanese drama. But I switched over to K drama after watching a Japanese drama called Hanayori Dango. And which is basically translates into Boys Over Flowers, when I found out that there was a K-drama version of it. Hanayori Dango is my favorite, favorite Japanese drama. Like, out of all the dramas I've ever seen, that is my favorite Japanese drama. And when I found out that there was a K-drama to it, I had to go over and watch it. Now, I don't know any Korean. I don't know any Korean. And I don't know much about Korean culture. What I do know, however, is that the majority of the K-pop singers, which is Korean pop, and the K-drama actors are absolutely gorgeous. It's like everybody is just perfect in some sense or another. So when I watched Hanayori Dango, which I think the Korean version is um, Boys Over Flowers, that's what it's called, or Flowers Over Boys, or something Thing. boys over flowers or flowers over boys I don't I don't remember which one it is and I watched the Korean version of it oh my god now for those of you who don't know what Hanayori Dango is I'm just gonna give you a little bit of background information of it Hanayori Dango is a, originally a manga that was created which centers around the lives of four guys and one girl the four guys they're known as F4 and the one girl She's known as Squishy. Now, I don't want to do no spoiler alert or anything for those of you who, I don't know, want to watch it, want to read it, whatever the case may be. So it's a movie. Well, no, it was a show based off of a manga originally. So the manga came first, followed by the show. The show has two seasons, and they're actually it's actually a pretty old show, um, followed by the movie. There's two movies. There's an older movie, like I think one is in the... 80s or 90s and then there's a newer movie which was done in the 2000s and for those of you who've seen Hanayori Dango you know there is two lead men in the movie you know you know you have your choice like it's like a team Jacob team Edwards type situation which is Dom Yoji or Hanaza Rui so now you have to pick you know who you like who you like who you like huh, 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 huh. I had conflicts throughout the whole entire thing but I ended up choosing Domyoji because I liked the way he was able to change throughout the course of the show and the movie and the book, whatever. So when I saw that there was a Korean one, I was automatically rooting for the Korean version of Domyoji. Oh my gosh. The actor who plays the Korean version of Domyoji is my future husband. His name is Lee Min Ho and I am fangirling so hard and I know I don't do videos like this but you guys I have to tell you how much I love this guy and his acting he does that role some serious justice like I was so conflicted as to did I like the Japanese version or did I like the Korean version after I finished watching the Korean version of Hana Yori Dango and falling completely in love with Lee Min Ho I decided to go back and watch his other works like the fangirl that I am so I found out he's relatively new or whatever the case may be I don't know but I went back and I watched all his other dramas in the time span I think of like two weeks I was that pressed you guys should definitely 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 get into some J drama and get into some K drama if you you don't, there's subtitles you don't have to you know speak Japanese or speak Korean I watch a lot of J-drama because I am a Japanese student. No, I am a student studying Japanese, so it helps me practice with my vocabulary and help me practice with my, you know, conversation and whatnot. So I focus more so on the J-drama. But ever since I found Lee Min Ho, I have not been able to stop watching K-drama. K-drama is so full of ups and downs and turnarounds and circle abouts and here and there's like, you will just be on the edge of your seat all the time all the time don't knock it until you try it guys and for those of you who have seen Hanayori Dango or for those of you who do watch J-drama and K-drama what's your favorite K-drama 
What's your favorite J-drama? Did you like Hanayori Dango, the Japanese version? Or did you like Boys Over Flowers, the Korean version? Do you like Hanazarui? Or do you like Dom Yoji? Leave all your answers down below if you've ever watched it and if you all your suggestions for any good K-dramas or J-dramas because I am a girl who likes to watch her dramas, okay? Share the love, watch a K-drama, watch a J-drama, support your Korean and Japanese actors, read some manga, watch some anime, do whatever you want to do, do whatever you got to do. Look up Lee Min Ho, look at how gorgeous he is. <laughs> Thanks guys for watching, I'll see you in another one. Bye!